Hi, my name is Hubble Jones and I've been attending St. John's for 10 years and I'll be attending Tampa Prep in the fall. Today I will be delivering Ronald Reagan's Challenger Disaster speech originally delivered in 1986 on January 28th. Ladies and gentlemen, I had planned to speak to you tonight to report on the State of the Union, except the events of earlier today have led me to change those plans. Today is a day for mourning and remembering. Nancy and I are pained to the core by the tragedy of the Shuttle Challenger. We know we share this pain with all of the people of our country. This is truly a national loss. Nineteen years ago, almost to the day, we lost three astronauts in a terrible accident on the ground, but we've never lost an astronaut in flight. We've never had a tragedy like this. Perhaps we've forgotten the courage it took, but they, the Challenger 7, were aware of the dangers and overcame their fears. For the families of the seven, we cannot bear as you do the full impact of this tragedy. Your loved ones were daring and brave and had that special grace, that special spirit that said, give me a challenge and I'll meet it with joy. I want to say something to the school children of America who are watching the live coverage of the shuttle's takeoff. I know it is hard to understand, but sometimes painful things like this happen. It's all part of the process of exploration and discovery and expanding man's horizon. The crew of the Challenger was pulling us into the future and will continue to follow them. We'll continue our quest in space. The crew of the space shuttle honored us by the manner in which they lived their lives. We will never forget them nor the last time we saw them this morning as they prepared for their journey and waved goodbye and slipped the surly bonds of earth to touch the face of God.